Welcome back to another segment of Mastering Phlebotomy. Today we're going to perform a venipuncture using butterfly syringe method. First, apply your tourniquet three to four inches above the site of incision. We're using the antecubital fossa and we've located the median cubital vein. We're going to use a 23 gauge butterfly for this procedure. When you're utilizing a syringe method, first you have to assemble the butterfly needle and connect the butterfly needle to the syringe. First, we're going to take the plunger of the syringe and flush the air out of the syringe three times. Disconnect the secondary needle from the butterfly needle. Attach the butterfly needle to the hub of the syringe device. We will use a transfer device to transfer the blood from the syringe into our vacutainer tube after successfully performing the venipuncture. Reapply the tourniquet once again, three to four inches above the site of incision. Palpate for the vein and clean the site with 70% alcohol for 20 seconds in concentric circles. Once you have prepped and cleaned the venipuncture site, allow the site to dry. Pick up your butterfly needle and anchor the vein, perform the venipuncture, inserting the needle at a five to 10 degree angle of insertion. Pull back on the plunger slowly, so that way air does not collect in the syringe and you do not collapse the vein. Slowly pull back on the plunger and allow blood to fill into the syringe. After blood has filled up inside the syringe, release your tourniquet. Use your two by two gauze and retract the butterfly needle safely. Apply pressure to the site with the two by two gauze. Disconnect the butterfly from the syringe device and attach the syringe to the transfer device so this way you can safely transfer your blood from the syringe into each respective vacutainer tube. Allow each tube to fill. With this collection, you can perform multiple tube collections being that we used a 10 cc syringe. So we could actually fill two complete vacutainer tubes, safely discard your butterfly needle after transferring the blood into each vacutainer tube. Go back to assess your patient, apply a Coflex bandage to the site, which will complete your venipuncture procedure. Make sure you take a look at your tubes. Invert your tubes eight to 10 times. And thank you for today.